Hello friends, this is Normal here for Technique and in this quick video we will show you how to configure VPN on Windows 10 mobile. So we have the Lumia 550 which runs Windows 10 and this is the latest version and we will show you how to configure the VPN on uh, this device. So uh, basically uh, the process uh, of configuring VPN uh, is a manual one. If you have a VPN app, you can directly configure with the VPN app but uh, not all uh, VPN services have apps for uh, Windows 10. So if you have a, a VPN provider, you can also manually configure it on your Windows 10 mobile. So uh, this uh, video will show you how to set this up. So uh, right now we have the Windows 10 uh, with uh, uh, the Lumia 550. Now uh, what you need to do is go to the settings. So just scroll down and uh, open the settings. And now you need to navigate to network and wireless. So under network and wireless, uh, you have this option called VPN. So just click this option. And now we can uh, see some options here. One is the add VPN option. So you need to select that option. So let's click add VPN. And now we get uh, additional pop-up window asking you to enter the manual setup for VPN. So just select uh, for the VPN service provider, just select Windows built-in. So that's the only option uh, available right now. And then next uh, is the connection name. So you can uh, enter any name for a connection, preferably uh, the, the service uh, provider, you can name uh, uh, the name, give the connection name. So we are using IBVPN, so let's enter IBVPN. So for this, uh, you can enter any, any name, any name which is suitable for you. Uh, next uh, is the server address. So this is very important part. So you need to figure out the server address for your VPN. So if you visit the website of your VPN service provider, you will get the server address. So server address will be multiple numbers. It will be located in US, UK, Europe, and a lot of other places. So based on which uh, connection you want to use, uh, you need to enter the server address. So here again, I will enter the server address uh, versus the uh, US server. So we'll just enter the server address. So we have now entered the server address. So click save. Now VPN type uh, is automatic. If you have a particular uh, protocol defined, you can just uh, uh, use that. You can see P P point to point tunneling protocol is there. PPTP, then L2TP, uh, then uh, we have other protocols as well. So based on whatever you require, you can just select. If you don't know any of this, just select automatic. And now uh, type uh, type of sign in info. You will obviously have a username and password. Uh, if there is no username and password provided, that means the VPN is free and you can directly connect it. If it's not a free connection, uh, you might need to enter a username and password. So let's just enter the username and password. So now we have uh, entered all the details required. Uh, so now we have entered the VPN name, the connection name uh, and uh, the server address, the username and password. Now click save. So now you can see we have added IBVPN as the new service provider. So if you just click here, you have these three options, connect, properties and remove. So properties will take you again to this option to configure them. So that's uh, another option. You can see connection properties. You can edit uh, whatever info we have entered here. So that uh, that can be edited. Uh, then uh, other proxy and other, other manual configuration can be done here. So we are not going into details of that because that will not be needed for most of the time. So in case you need additional properties, you can just go here and if you want to remove it, you have this option. Now let's go and connect it. So just click here and it will verify your credentials. So you can see uh, it's now connecting. So it will just take a couple of seconds. So you can see completing the connection and now it's connected. So once it is connected, if you go here, you can see the notification center, the quick toggle IBVPN is connected. So VPN is now ready for action. Now uh, if you go to the web browser, and uh, if you select IP address, so there you go. We have just uh, done the lookup of IP address and you can see it's uh, a USA. That's uh, the server we have connected. So using this, now we are connected it uh, anytime. If you don't want, uh, I mean, if you want to disconnect it, uh, you can just go here to the notification center and uh, uh, I mean, just turn this off and you can uh, disconnect it. And now the VPN is dis disconnected. So that's how we configure a VPN on the Windows 10 mobile. It's a simple process. Uh, you just need to have the details like the server address and your user credentials to create uh, a VPN connection. So that's all guys uh, with this video tutorial on how to create uh, a VPN connection on Windows 10 mobile. So hope you like this video. Don't forget to hit the like button and also subscribe to YouTube channel for more videos. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.